Hello, hello, hello. I'm, this is a live, so I'm going to be waiting for everybody to come on in. I'm going to give it a few minutes for everybody to come in. I'm about to go share it on my group real quick. When you come in, say hello. Hello, I see three people here. I'm gonna wait for some more people to come in. My name is Charmaine. Welcome. Oh, it went from three to 24. Hey, hey, hey. Y'all in here, y'all in here. I'm just sharing it on my page real quick. So go ahead and say hello and where you're from. I'm going to um, Brown Girls Craft for Cricket on Facebook to share it. Not a member of my group, check us out. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, hey Jade, hey Fabulosis, hey, hey Lisa, hey Cooking with So Cooking Creative, Catering, sorry. Yes, hello everyone, hello. Hey Kim, hey Brenda, hey Tanisia, Lisa, Yolanda, Benny Mack from Chicago, Shakia, Gwendolyn, Nadea, Nadia. Sorry, Laverne. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, let me. Hey, crafting. Um, Miss Crafty Creations. Gail. Hey, Lachelle. Yolanda. Erica. From California. Hey, Southern California. It never rains in Southern Cal. Oh, sorry. Let me keep my day job. Hey, y'all. Hey. Let me go ahead and get to this. Let me go ahead and share this on my group. If you um, like this video so I can get started, we are going to be sublimating some mugs. Look at my sublimation shirt I made. Ow. Love sublimation, y'all. Love sublimation. Let me, um, hey, Jada from um, Texas. Let me share it to my group for the third time. Let me just shut up and do it, right? Come on, computer. Come on, internet. Why is internet always going to be bugging when I get on it? Come on, internet, stop bugging. Tell them. Stop it. Oh, I need to go to YouTube first, don't I? Today has been a crazy day. I've been getting a lot of stuff done. What am I doing? YouTube. Sorry, y'all. I gotta share it on my page. Just go ahead and say, hey, hey. Come in and hit that like button. Thank you, Fabulous. I got 18 likes. What's up? I got eight, I got 80 people in here. Hey, welcome. If you're a newbie, say, um, you're a virgin. If you're a virgin here, say virgin. We'll shout you out. I got 80 people watching right now. Thanks for coming out. We're coming, <laughs> joining us. You ain't going nowhere. You at home. Ooh, look at that forehead. Let me cover this up. Good Lord. Jesus. Let me can try to cover this up up here. You know, it's a lot up there. Um, where am I looking for? Hey, Linda. Hey, Sherry from Maryland. Um, what was I doing? Let me see. Let me focus, y'all. Let me focus. Copy and paste. Okay, you sitting at home watching watching me. Okay. I like that. I like that. Thanks for watching me. Hope I hope, hope you learned something from this video. Y'all, let me tell you, I'm not looking at y'all because I'm getting this stuff together, but girl, let me tell you yesterday, I did a video yesterday, I got to check it out so y'all can probably laugh at me if y'all want to, but I do show y'all things that you don't do. Oh, that was rhyming. Laugh if you want to, because I'm going to show you some things that you ain't going to do. <laughs> I'm whack. But anyway, <laughs> anyway, watch my video from yesterday. It was alive and I was just, mm, I was doing some things, y'all. Y'all watched it, y'all know. So go and watch my video yesterday. I embroidered a shirt. Hey, Nikita. And uh, and a patch. So go check it out so you can laugh with uh, everybody else was laughing at me. Don't laugh at me, but laugh with me. How about that? But it was informative. It was informative. So go ahead and check the video out. Yesterday when I sublimated a shirt. I mean, sorry. When I um embroidered a shirt and a patch. It was some crazy moments. Y'all can tell. Don't tell them what happened, y'all. But who was on there? Let me see y'all hearts and y'all y'all waves or whatever. That y'all was on that video yesterday. The breast embroidery machine to start with is the PE 800. Who was on that sh um, show yesterday, y'all? Who was on my live yesterday? Was that yesterday or day before yesterday? Let me see y'all waves or y'all y'all. Let me see y'all purple hearts on the bottom. Let me see y'all purple hearts if y'all was on there yesterday. Let them know. Go watch that live. Y'all can laugh with me, but don't laugh at me. How about that? Yeah, it was informative. Dang, what am I doing? Okay, I gotta go. 
What are you doing? Supplement? What are you supplement? Okay, Sherry was there. Okay, Sherry, I see you. Uh, let me see. Who else was there yesterday on my live? Okay, Fabulous, I know you was there. Jay was there. Oh, girl, what am I doing? I need to monitor. I need to. Let's see our purple hearts. Hey, Cheryl Foster. Let me see that purple hearts if you was there yesterday. Oh, you're doing a secret. I love secret pillows. They're nice to do. They're fun. I'm trying to fight, hide this. Hopefully. Let's see. Why it's not doing, y'all? What is going on? Copy. Okay, the shell was there. Kim was there. Why is this doing this, y'all? I'm trying to share this. Okay, Stephanie was there. Okay, I'm, I'm getting to this video real quick. I just got, I'm just still trying to share. My computer acting a fool up in here, up in here. Okay, there we go. I got it. Um, is that a pimple? Oh, I'm sorry. Let me see. Okay, what else everybody working on today? I just made a photo mug. Okay, that's what we doing today, y'all. That's what we doing today. Lorraine, Lorraine just said, oh, I bit my, my, my mouth. Lorraine, I'm just getting all excited. Got me bite myself. Dang. <laughs> oh, my God. Lorraine just said she made a photo mug. Shana was in the house. Hey, Shana, with your green hearts. Um, what did I say? Shana, somebody just said they just made a photo mug. We're going to do that today. We're going to make a photo mug today, y'all. Everybody been asking me how to make photo mugs, okay? How to put photos on your mug. So we're going to do that today. I just bit my mouth. Okay. So let me go ahead and plug in the Easy Press. I mean the Cricut Easy Press. I am using the Cricut Easy Press. I love it. I love it. I love it. So if you don't have it, you better get it. And I, No, I'm not trying to make you spend your money. But I'm just letting you know. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's a nice machine to have. It's easier. I do have the... Um, I say this on all of my videos. So if y'all are new to this video, y'all know what's up. Instead of thinking or guessing, I do have a, um, the um, the oven, the, the convection oven. And I also have a... Uh, I always forget what this is called. The um, air fryer. I always forget the air fryer. I have that. I love the air fryer. I've been using the air fryer for about a year or so. But it's more steps to use the air fryer in the um, convection oven. When you do want using the Cricut mug press, it's one step. Bam, you're done. And I also have the um, I also have a tumbler press too. And it's only one step. Bam, you're done. But you can also use you also you can also sublimate with using convection oven and um air fryer i have videos on both of those you can do those with tumblers or mugs okay but today we are going to use the cricket easy press i'm going to turn on let it heat up we're going to see how long it's going to heat up right now it is 7 18 so we're going to see how long it'll take the heat up when it's once it beep that means it's ready and this is my first time timing it so i know too how long it takes to heat up they don't take they don't take long at all okay so Let's get started. I get my tumblers from um, Condi. If you ask for Chloe Smith, she'll give you a discount. Check out Chloe Smith at Condi.com. I'm using their mugs. I get all my mugs from them. I love it. I just got a new shipment in because I'm doing a vendor table. Y'all probably really big this Saturday. So wish me luck on that. Um, I'm going to do a lot of mugs tonight so I can have some mugs to put on my table. I have a lot of things I need to already, they're already done that I already made. Like I got notebooks, calendars journals stuff like that i already made so that's ready for the table i have bags and stuff that i made um I'm do some tum i'm gonna do some mugs tonight i got a few tumblers i might do some tumblers not on video though i'm gonna do some more tumblers um it's on saturday so i got all day tomorrow to work 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 making stuff for this table and of course i'm going to show y'all live if y'all my group i could probably put a little um shorty too a shorty video on youtube showing y'all my table tomorrow too thank you thank you she said good luck fam me let to uh, sorry, I missed up the name. She said, "Good luck. Where do you get your shirts, mate? Where do you get your shirts like when you have on?" This is a cricket shirt, believe it or not. This V-neck. This is cricket. I use a lot of stuff when I make my shirts. I use cricket shirts because when I um, I really, I mean, I could, but I unless it's kids shirts. I really don't sell cricket shirts when I put in my customers. They're good shirts. They are good shirts. And this is a V-neck, so I, I like to do. Cause people don't really ask for V-neck, so I make myself V-neck so I can just see how they look. 
But it's a cricket shirt, believe it or not. Cricket shirt. You, you can tell it's cricket the way that the way it is. I just know when it's a cricket shirt. That's why I know. Cricket got good shirts. Go to their website. They be having sales on their shirt. Cricket.com. Um, and when you heat up this cricket machine, this cricket mud press, you can smell it. It's like a sweet smell. It's not a strong smell, but it smell like a little sweet smell. That's crazy, ain't it? It's not really strong like most um heat presses and stuff like that. Oh yeah, this is um these are this is a medium. I'm this is a medium shirt. It stretches, see? It stretches real good. But um, most of my shirts I still get from Condi.com. They have the so far they have the best shirts for me for sublimation. Condi.com. They have the Viper shirts or Vapor shirts. They are wonderful, but they are kind of expensive. But you get what you pay for, honey. I love the Viper shirts. Shorts shirts. They go to all the way to four X or five X. So check out Condi.com if you're trying to find some nice shirts. They're a little bit more expensive, but they are nice. Cause I've been, I was going to a different kind of company to get shirts, and they was the raw material. And I'm not trying to sell those little silky shirts and stuff. I'm not trying to. And I, I get them Jiffy Mix. J I always say Jiffy Mix, y'all. Disclaimer, I do talk fast, so that's what it is. Um, I do get some of my shirts from JiffyShirts.com. And like I said, sometimes I mix up and I get the wrong type of shirts. I put in polyester. And some of them polyester shirts be too shiny and too, too flimsy and you see through. So be careful. But like I said, if you're looking for some good quality shirts, go to Condi. Condi.com and ask for Chloe Smith and she'll get a discount if you say my name, my name, my name. You gotta say my name though. Charmaine Galloway. And also I have links below this video. After this is done, I'll put links below the video of everything that I um use on this video. And if you use uh, some of my um links, I will get a certain percentage off of it. So thank you. The money goes to my channel and I appreciate you. Um check out my website, Brown Girls Craft and Cricket. That's my Facebook page, sorry. My website is Charming Gal Boutique. When I make all these things myself, if you don't want to make them, you can come to me and purchase them for me. Charming Gal Boutique, number two on Etsy. And also my Children Boutique, which is a Ray of Sunshine Boutique on Etsy. And I know my girl going to put it in the links below, and it also will be under my video below, too. Let's see what your question is. Okay, see, it beeped now. So, 18, so about four minutes, okay? It take about four minutes for it to, um, to cool off. I mean, to get... To get it together, to get right, the Cricut machine, Cricut Easy Press, okay? Four minutes to get warmed up, and it's, that's not bad at all because they, sometimes that convection never take a long time to get heat up. The, the um the um, air fryer don't take that all. You just put the cup in there and let it, let it bake for like eight minutes for the air fryer, my air fryer that I use. Excuse me, but I, you know I have to get to this little gadget because um so I can show y'all how to, so I can do videos and show y'all how to do it. That's my excuse. If I buy something new, I say I do it because of y'all so I can show y'all how it works. So I hope y'all love me for that, cause I'm spending my money. <laughs> but I love doing it. Y'all know I love doing it. Okay, so let me go to Silhouette. I do use Silhouette. I use the Business Edition, but you can use um, you can use the free version. But I use the Business Edition. I say this in all my videos because you might be the first person, first time listening to me. I use Silhouette to um for all my sublimation. I cannot. I don't know how to use um. What's that? The other the other stuff. The other program people always use. I can't think of somebody about to say, what's the program everybody uses and that's really hard to use? I wish I knew how to do it. Photoshop. I don't know how to use Photoshop, but Photoshop is a good place to use when you're trying to sublimate. Let me slow down, Charmaine. Photoshop is a great program to use when you sublimation, when you use the sublimation, when you're doing sublimation. Silhouette is a good one because basically those two programs, they print big, okay? Also, we're perfect. You can print out big. So for all those, I, I think Photoshop, you can print out bigger than um, no, you can't. I'm sorry. Photoshop, Silhouette, and my Microsoft Word. It's another one, too. I don't have it, but I know it's another one you can print out big. I can't think of what it's called, but anybody know, y'all can put it in the thing. I use my Epson printers. I converted them. I do have videos on how to convert them. I got more videos on how to um, work with Silhouette. Infinity. It's another one. Inkscape. I was thinking about Inkscape. Inkscape. So, yeah, Infinity and Inkscape. Thank you, y'all. Thank you. So, Infinity and Inkscape, you can print bigger. I don't have, I don't use them. Canva. Um, doc, Canva do print big, too, but I'm not sure how big they print. I don't think it's no 11 by 17, okay? I'm not sure about Canva, but I know Canva do print big. But I don't know about 11 by 17. So, in this printers, you can use 11 by 17 paper. The biggest I go you go up to is 13 by 19, okay? Today, I'm using 11 by 17. I got the mug press, but really haven't used it. You better get it. It's so easy. I'm telling you, it's like so easy. I'm about to show y'all now. 
how to use it. Well, I have videos on how to use it, but I'm doing photos today, okay? What about to say? Um, so yeah, 13 by 19 is the biggest paper, largest paper you can use in these machines. Love them, okay? I love my machine. Let me show you again. Everybody want to know. Everybody ask me the question. Every time I video what printers I use, I use the uh, Epson 7710 and then 7720. The only difference between the 7710 and the 7720 is that the 7720 has two shell, two racks, okay? Two racks. That's it. They both print the same. And this is out farther because I've got the 11 by 17 paper in there right now. Okay, and I'm old school, y'all. I plug my stuff in because my internet is, is crazy sometimes. So, y'all already know about that. I like my shirt, y'all. I love my shirt. I sell a lot of these shirts, y'all. I sell a lot of these shirts on my website. I love it. My roots, baby. Okay, now let me go ahead and show y'all what it looked like over here on this um, computer. You got to get off my little forehead. My big, not my little forehead. <laughs> um, get me out the camera. Okay, so these photos are the ones I'm going to be putting on the mugs. Um... And basically what I did was, it's basically a photo, photos that I got from, um, they, they inboxed them to me and I just put them, I just basically merged them right here into, um, into silhouette, which right here, merges right here, right? So I just merge them in and, um, and I just make the size I want to make them, okay? So the size I need to make these is for my cups. I measured them. Let me show y'all real quick. So how you measure your cups. What the heck? Are we trying to be um together? You know what? The the um the easy their press might go to be ready right now. No, it's only four minutes to um to heat up. I got a hundred and eighty hundred and no, I had a hundred thirty nine. Now I got hundred ten. What's up? Where y'all going? I got a hundred and nine people going right now. I'm measuring this cup, it went from a hundred and thirty to one hundred nine. Y'all want me to set what to make today? <laughs> okay. So this is how you measure. You take the measuring tape and you just measure it. So it says um. About three and a half, right? Three and a half. And then you go by how you want it to go. Like, for me, I don't do my whole cup. I, oh, now I went back to 142. I mean, 141. So I don't know what's going on with my printer, my computer. So, yeah, I got 141 people watching right now. I got 71 likes. Can y'all say thumbs up for me, please? Thumbs up. Come out and put thumbs up and come back in. So then, like I said, I always, I could do the whole cup, but I really don't never do a whole cup. And people all, oh, it froze up. Okay. Um, I, I really don't, um do a whole cup i really don't people love it you could put a whole you could put a, the picture around the whole cup but i don't okay um and my my customers like it it's just like this so i usually do like the front of the cup so when they're drinking the cup you can see it right here okay so i go from probably right here to probably about i'm gonna say about four four inches four inches wide okay so i go by four inches wide to 3.5 height okay that's how I measure. So if you want to know how you measure the photo, that's how you do it. Make sure you have a nice photo so if it stretch out, you'll be, it'll be able to, um, you could be able to, um, see, it won't look bad. It won't, um, I can't think of the darn word right now. But y'all know what I mean. My words is not right together today. It won't, um. Thank you for the $5 super chat, you vet white in. Thank you. She said, hi, Charmaine. Hi, I appreciate you. Ching ching. Thanks for the super chat. Okay, so, um, okay, let me show y'all. I'm gonna size these up, these pictures up real quick. She finally caught me on live. Hey, Sheila. Hey, okay, so what I'm gonna do is I click on the picture, and then I go up to the top right here, and I just put four width, and then 3.5 enter and that's the size it's gonna look is that's the size it's gonna be real small because that's the size it is you know i can use eight and a half by eleven paper for real for real but i'm gonna go ahead and do it like this and then this the name i'll put the names on the back of them right um which name do y'all think look better this right here if y'all can see that this right here is milkshake font which i think is better and this right here is uh matilda tell me which one that font i should use the matilda font or should I use the um, milkshake font? Tell me which one I should use, y'all. Milkshake. I like milkshake too, y'all. I do. It looks. It looks cute. That looks okay. It's like, but I think it'll be more eligible to read if you do. If I use the milkshake. So let me know. Let me get some votes. Let me see y'all votes. Milkshake right here, or um, Matilda. Yeah, everybody say milkshake. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna change this to milkshake. There we go. Milkshake. So this, I'm gonna measure this to see how much I want this to be. I probably want this to be like a. Shoot, let me check my cup first. Let me change this to a four. 
four by three point five. 3.5 and I'm also gonna do her like I said I'm doing some shirts I'm doing some cups today for the vendor table when I get off the live with y'all I'm gonna do some more but I'm gonna do her too so y'all can see how it look without being a photo with no background on it she's beautiful I'm not just selling this so I'm gonna do another one four by three and a half three okay 3.5 like I said, I have more videos on show you how to use silhouettes, so check those videos out. And what I do is place all these on the paper. This is 11 by 17 paper, so I can fit all these on here. Okay, let me know, y'all. Whoever used silhouette, how do I get this line out of here? Somebody told me I'd do it before. I forgot. Next time I need to write it down. I'm so sick of these lines. And my dog, on, um, my silhouette be always acting up. Every time I turn around, I be having issues with the silhouette. I can't, I just... Ugh. I love it to do my designs in, but I'm always having, I always got to, you know, delete it and put it back up. I don't know if it's my computer, if it's just silhouette acting crazy, but these lines right here, I want to get these away, get these rid, get rid of these lines. Where do I go? Somebody told me how to go over here in settings or something, but I forgot. So tell me how to do it so I can get these lines out of here, this arrow thing, whatever that is. Help me, help me, help me, because I'm not good at some of these stuff on silhouette. I'm still learning. I know a lot, but this right here, I can't remember how to get this line out of here. And then when I've been using my, um, it's the grid line. Okay, how I take the grid line off, Michelle? Do I go? I know I go to settings somewhere. Settings. Let me go here and do this and look for grid. Let me see where I go. Somebody told me before, but I can't remember. Go to where? I hate those lines too. Well, we about to figure out how to get rid of them, Sandra, Faye. I thought it was settings, right, Michelle? Please help me. Please help me, help me, help me. I have to learn how to use my silhouette. I don't like this. I have the silhouette. I don't use the silhouette. I don't use the cameo. I just use silhouette to um, design because the cameo is too much, too much, too much stress. I use Cricut and just go right to, um, I go right to doing my business. But silhouette got too many steps. Cameo got too many steps. <laughs> you got to make, you got to do too many. It's too many steps, y'all. So I just cook, I cook, cut with my Cricut and my silhouette. I only used it one time. Sorry, but I'm going to keep it though because um I can do it. I can figure it out. I might do some videos on it after I learn how to work with it. I just got to be patient. I learned scale. Oh, I heard scale was cool, too. Okay, anybody can help me get this line out of here, or I can just go ahead and go on. I don't know if it's under. She said it's grid. Let me see if I can find grid. Registration marks? No. No, no. Is it twos? Is it twos? No. Hey, okay, I'm going to just get out of here. I'm just hoping somebody can help me. Select shape. While I was on here... I love your shirt. I need to make that. Okay, let me just get out of here. There's somebody helping me. Okay, so let me go ahead and measure the cup again and see how big I want these work these um these names to be on the back of the cause I put my names on the back of the cup. Okay. Oh, go to tools. Yes, tools. Okay, and what else I do? File. Cause it's an easy thing to do. Cause I did it. Somebody told me how to do it on live before. <laughs> and they helped me on live and they showed me how to do it. Yes, you were just on it. Go back and drop down box. Okay, let me see. Oh, grids. Grids. It's still there. Go to preference. Unlock the center rotation. Oh, go to preference and unlock the center rotation. Preference. Unlock the center rotation. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, I'll do it another time. I don't know what I'm, what I'm doing. Hold on. Just try it. One more time up here. Preference and go to... Center rotation, right? Preference, okay. Center rotation. I don't see it, y'all. I don't see it, y'all. Center oh, two. Center rotation. Okay, I'm. I'm gonna just do it another time. I'm trying to show y'all. If y'all, they show me, I can show y'all. We will try another time. Somebody can inbox me and show me. I went to. I went to where you told me to go, but I don't see it. Okay. Okay, so I'll do it another time. I appreciate y'all help though, but this is this little grid thing. Go to tab that says tools. I'll do it another time. Thank you though. Okay, so but now what I'm doing is I got all my stuff. It's all measured. Okay, sometimes it's gonna still be off because that's what it does. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead. Oh, see, it's beeping right now, telling me you better use me. I'm about to cut off, so I'm gonna let it go ahead and cut off because I got a print still. So I'll just go ahead and bring it back on in a minute. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and put the camera on back on me. Hey, hey, hey. Um. So let me go ahead and, um, okay, if you're trying to join my group, please go to my, I'm very, very busy. 
and it's hard for me to look through names. But go to my Facebook page, Charmaine Galloway, and inbox me and say your name so I can look. For, just go ahead and find your name individually and add you to the group like that. So I know you watch me on my live, so that means you must care, you must like me. So if you like me, I'll put you in my group. But there's so many people that want to, I still got a thousand people that want to get in that group. So um, just go ahead and go to Charmaine Galloway, my Facebook page, message me and just say your name, You're trying to get in the group. And then I'll add you tonight when I look at my messages, I'll go ahead into the group and find you, okay? Worked for me, worked for you. But I got to go through that list. It's like people are trying to get in that group. I copied this from the internet. What you copied from the internet? Okay, I think I'll make the name like a two, two and a half inches wide and an inch, okay? Two and a half by, let me see. Two and a half, well, yeah, two and a half. So I'm just, I'm just basically switch, um, making it smaller. I can't show y'all cause my hand, my, I'm on my computer. Two and a half, dang, that's gonna be small. Two and a half. I'm just um and that's small. I'm gonna just do it. Um I'm gonna do three. That looks tiny. I'm gonna do it by three and a half. Oh, oh that's too big. That's too big. I'm gonna do three. It looks small. Sorry, I'm not showing y'all, but my hand I gotta use both of my hands. Um, okay, so now I'm going to, I'm just like I said, I'm just mix um making the name fit on the cup, my size I want. What? Yes, son. Are they a what? Mm. Something happened. You lied. Yeah, I'm lying. Oh. Something happened. So, no, it was at school. Okay, tell me when you get off. Of. I thought something just happened. Tell me, my girl. No, say hi. Say hi, Shane. It's my son. He always trying to run from the camera. Bye. Charmaine, is your logo Amazing Grace? That's my daycare. My my daycare is called Amazing Grace. Um, so I'm just showing. Let me show y'all what I'm doing. I'm just basically making the name smaller. Um, this right here says it's 1.1, no, I don't want that big, one by one inch. And then I want it about 3.5 wide. I did want about three, but it looks so tiny. I'm going to do a 3.4 stop. Oh, they say, hello, Shane. He, he, he seen that. He pointed like, my, somebody, I'm like, why are you looking at him pointing at my phone? He see, you say, hey, Shane. Hi. He don't want to be on the camera. I ain't going to put you on the camera, boy. Uh, three, so it'd be about three. Always running, trying to run from the camera. Okay, so that's good. It looks so tiny to me. I hope y'all can see. I'm sorry, y'all can't see. I, I just don't like doing videos on my on my computer because it's hard to see. Yeah, he's so shy. He he reading. He up here laughing at y'all talking about how shy he is. He he reading the post right now on my phone. He right he right next to me. But <laughs> <laughs> Get out. Okay, so that is. 1.7 by 3.1. That should be good. I should go ahead and do a one because it's all it's on the back. I usually don't like my um my name that big, but it'll be okay because it's gonna be on the back of the the back of the cup. How was your day at school today, Shane? Good. Okay, I said good. Okay, three. I'm gonna do three. Okay, one. Okay, I'm I think I'm good. I'm gonna say hey, Shane. <laughs> he laughed. Why you dip your cheek? <laughs> Beat it. Okay. Um. He said hey, hello. He was like, "Ma, can you please, uh, uh, what he say? What you say? Please shout me out in your videos so I can get some videos on YouTube." <laughs> now you laughing at me. <laughs> I don't know what he's trying to do on YouTube. He's like, "Ma, I'm trying to be like you." I'm like, "Nah, son, be better than me." I don't know what he's trying to do, but he's trying to do something on YouTube. Okay, that's all I can do now. I'm scared. It's even though it looks like this, it's gonna be so much bigger after I print it out, and that's what I hate. But uh, let me just measure the cup one more time so I can see. <laughs> how did you do that? Okay, so I said three, yeah, three, well, that's too big, three inches, like that, I do, three inches, it do, wide, and then a, a point, one point one length. Okay, that's good. So I'll be doing this all night. See, I like to really step, like, really concentrate before I do stuff, so I'll be taking all the day trying to figure it out, because I ain't trying to mess up this stuff when I'm printing this stuff out for, for customers. So that's what I do. Okay. So the pictures are all done. Let me take y'all back here because y'all don't want to look at me. Okay. So now what I do is um, I go to everything is good. This is how I want it to be. Um, I wish you would have sent me a color picture. It would be much better in color. I meant to tell her that too. But color is so much prettier when you do. I mean, that's a pretty picture though. But um, color just pops when you do sublimation. Okay. So now I'm going to print that up. And then I make sure I got the right printer, which is right here. The, 11, the paper is 11 by 17. That's right. Then I push OK. So everything's set up right there. 
But then I go to file and then I go to print. Uh, ooh, okay, so this, I push print. Then I go to make sure media quality and I put layout, make sure it's close, it's flipped horizontally or it would not work. Every time you use, every time you use this kind of print, you have to flip it horizontally if it's not a sublimation printer. Now my printer over here that I have over here, I don't have to flip it because this is a sublimation printer, right? This is the big baby right here. This prints uh 24 by 17, okay? 24 by 17. And people are like, you gonna print something that big? No, I don't. But I can if I want to. But the reason why I got that printer because I can print a lot of things at one time. Like I could do like 20 masks at one time. I can do 20 mugs at one time instead of doing three or four at a time on this 11, 11 by 17 paper. Get it? Okay, so right now I only could do like four or five mugs because of the paper size. And if I use a 13 by 19, I could probably do like six mugs at a time, printing them out basically. Like see right here, I got room for like one, two, three, about four more, five more on this sheet. If I pull this stuff up, I can do probably about five mugs on here, right? But if I do that printer over there, I could be spitting out mugs like it ain't nothing. So now I'm just going to get my printer set. Let me fill this down by 17 paper. And it's printing out, baby. It's printing out. <sighs> How was y'all week? This week this week went by kind of fast. I'm going to push the print. I mean, I'm about to push the um, mug press back on so it can start up, warm up, heat up, get it together. Let me see. Let me just show y'all it's coming out. Excuse my mess. Good Lord. Okay, look, there it is. Did it flip? Yeah, it flipped. You flip by the um, words. Them dang old words is too big. But it's going to be okay because it's the only thing on the back of the, sh on the, back of the cup. We're gonna, we about to see if it's okay. Because if it's not, I'm going to print it over. But I just wanted to see how it looked. Is that upside down? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna cut it out with my scissors, of course. Let me find my scissors. So, uh, well, you know what? Usually, I tear. It's it's better to tear when you're using um sublimation because all the when you cut, it can leave that line in the print, right? So I, I tear. So be careful. You can tear it, so it won't do that harsh line. That line will show up on your um, on your on your item. Okay. Well, that's something some people didn't know. Even right here, it's this harsh edge right here. Tear it because if it, you don't, it can show up on your shirts. Of course, very much so, it can show up on your shirts. So just tear around the picture so you can get that, uh, that harsh line out of there. Okay, that's how it's going to look. Okay, make sure them edges is torn. Okay. Took me a long time to figure that out, but I got you, I got it, so now I'm telling y'all. Okay. The same way. So I throw this away. The same thing for the, everything else. You just cut. You just tear it. So you can, um, okay, there it is. It's ready for me to heat up. You just tear it, tear it, tear it. So the harsh lines can go away. But sometimes it don't, the harsh lines don't go in the cup. I mean, it don't, it don't print on the cup. But just, just, I just tear everything, okay? But definitely, definitely, definitely tear it, your paper, for your, um, for your, um, your shirts. And your other image, any kind of other things you do. See, now this is done. Okay, then we'll do the same thing for this. If you didn't know that let me see your hearts if you just learned something today if you didn't know that you should tear let me see your hearts so hope i be teaching y'all something when y'all come on y'all i'll be trying so I, I tear as close as i can you don't have to worry about tearing too close because the white would not show so just tear as close as you can and don't worry about it okay this is one picture this other picture so they're ready to go in the cup lord please let it be let it fit and i like to, i like to do it real close because i want to see how close how much is gonna be on that cup? You know what I'm saying? I wanna make sure it's even on the cup and it's hard to tell when you're using um so like I said, sometimes I usually cut. I usually cut for real for real. I usually cut for my cups and mugs because you can't tell when you're using when you're doing a cup or a cup or a mug. You really can't get the harsh part. But um for my shirts, I definitely I know I said that like three times though. I like to repeat myself, I don't know why. Forgive me. But I do cut for cups. Okay. Sorry, I just did all that. But for, since this one's like this, I'm gonna go ahead and leave it like that. I'm, I'm gonna tear that and leave it like that, okay? But these pictures, I wanna make sure it's on the, um, it's right. So what I do now, I'm gonna move my computer out the way. I usually have something like a, 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 a tower or something. So make sure when somebody, if your customer is right-handed, you make sure it's right, she right-handed or whatever, you make sure you put it on the right side of the cup. So I put it 
right here. I just kind of look kind of greasy. I'm gonna wipe it off a little bit because my hands are kind of, you know, I had to put some vaseline on my hands because I was kind of ashy. <laughs> so now my cup is kind of. So make sure you wipe it off. Make sure you know hand prints on here when you sublimating. Okay, my hands is kind of. Okay, I, I like the hearts. I see the hearts. Oh, let me get my tape, y'all. Forgot the tape. You do need sublimation tape. I, that's the only thing you need with this. You don't need no paper, none of that. You just need sublimation tape. I'm about to go get it. I'll be right back. It's called heat tape. Not sublimation tape. It's called heat tape. I'm sorry. Heat tape. This is right here. And I got the camera down so you can be able to see what I'm doing. That's the reason why it's down. So here we go. So basically, I put the picture where I want it. So I, I want it about right here. Perfect fit, y'all. Oh, my goodness. See, you got to write this stuff down so you can have it, y'all. I write stuff down so I know I don't have to worry about thinking about what size it is. This Your cups might be different, but if you get it from Condi, um, I use the width is 4 by 3.5. And the height is 3.5, okay? Lord Jesus. My tape just got... Just use a little bit of tape just to hold the paper down to keep it tight onto the cup make sure it's straight and that's all you got to do y'all so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna go ahead and cut the name out so i can um put that on the back of the cup real quick this is miss coleman there's the name right here so i'm gonna turn the cup around See, the tape is too long, I think. I'm going to put the tape around. Let me see where I'm going to put the... I'm going to take... That tape is too long. Let me cut... Well, I can use this tape, too, to um put that on here. So, hope I can get no residue on here. Okay, so I'm going to put it about... Probably about right here. Right here. <laughs> hmm, about right here. I don't like big stuff, y'all. Maybe I could have made the words, the name bigger. But you know me, I just don't like big stuff. So, but that don't mean that my 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 clients don't like it. I should have could have made it bigger. I'm not. I'm still working on my size and different stuff. So yes, yeah, it's, it's okay. But it could have been bigger. The name could have been bigger. Uh. Okay. Let me tape some tape right here. Okay, so this is how it looks. This side is done. That's the picture. And then the name on the back. Okay, so now I'm about to go ahead and put in a heat press. And like I said, I do not know how long it takes, but I'm about to go ahead and um, time it. So I can see how long it takes to um, heat up. Is Right now it is 7.48. Put it right here in the easy press. I mean, what is this? Is, is this it? Just set it right in. There we go. And then we just close it. That's all we got to do, y'all. And we just wait for it to stop until it beep. And we ready. And we ready. I got 159 people watching. Hey, hey, hey. I have a $5 super chat. Thank you so much. I got 161, 116 likes. Can we get some more likes, please? Likes, please. I'm going to do two more mugs and I'll be out of here. I told y'all I was going to do a video on how to, how to sublimate how to see well i'm gonna see if um sublimate sublimating those dollar tree notebooks without the glitter works somebody told me they was doing it somebody inboxed me yesterday and told me they were trying to do it, it didn't work for them but i know somebody on youtube did do a video on no, i mean on facebook did do a video on them but they were not dollar tree so dollar tree might not work but i just bought them just in case just to check it out and see if they work and if they don't work it's just something i just have to throw up you know just use for myself but i'm just gonna just go do a video and show you if it works or not so y'all can know if it works y'all go get them if not y'all don't have to do it but the video is be coming i'm gonna be busy this weekend with the um my getting my vendor stuff together so i might not do it until next week i've been i've been doing good y'all i've been trying to get on here and do videos for y'all because i have been missing the action quite a few times but now i'm back i'm trying to get it together trying to be consistent Whew, that's hard y'all it's hard i'm trying i got so much going on i got so many orders like right now we just wait on the um we just wait on the heat press i'm just talking my little gabbing off so i can see so I can tell y'all what's going on. Like that, like it, like it, like it. Thank you. Like the video. I got okay. This is the mugs I'm doing right now. Let's do today. Those are I'm doing those two. The two mugs. Then I have a, a 
Brown James patch I gotta do. And I'm gonna show y'all address, but here's my invoices, okay, from Etsy. I got three more due. Y'all done, I just shipped today. I shipped six things out today. So if y'all were looking for y'all socks, I made socks. I did like six or seven patches. So those got mailed out to, to today, yesterday, okay? So I got Kobe Bryant. Not Kobe Bryant, who is this? LeBron James. Um, another another patch, a, little, a girl with an afro patch. And I got Kobe Bryant, because I've been doing Kobe Bryant all the time. They want two patches. So I got to get these done. I was supposed to do these tonight, y'all. What's today? Today Today is the... Today, tomorrow the third. So these do out tomorrow, okay? So I'm going to do these tonight when I got the video. Patches are so easy. Just put it in the machine. Y'all see me? I picked my video yesterday. Y'all can check out and see how fast I can do a patch. Um, so they easy. So I do those tonight. It's still early for me. I don't go to bed until like midnight. So it's only eight o'clock. So yeah, I get it done. Okay. Let me ask y'all questions. I've been talking a lot today. Hey, miss. I was about to say, hey, miss Parker. I thought I see miss Parker. Where miss Parker been? I ain't seen her. Are you here? Miss Parker. Um, did you resize the picture? I'm late. What you mean? Did I resize the picture. Hey, let me see. I use Condi mug paper. They have two sizes. Condi mug paper. Let me go through and see if y'all say anything. Um, hey, Sonya. Hey, Gail. Linda. What side? Did you resize the pictures? I did, the pictures are 4 by 3.5. I see y'all hearts. Alcohol is my friend. <laughs> Why you say that, Michelle? I missed it. What size mugs are they? I'm not sure. I think they're 10 ounces. I'm not sure, y'all. I'm the, I think it's a 10 ounces. It might be... I don't know. Sorry, I don't know how to figure that out. I don't have a scale to measure it. Uh, go ahead and hit the like button. Yes, yes, yes. Can't wait to see it. Um, have you heard of the uh, DTF? Is that the direct transfer? What do DTF mean? The direct transfer format? Direct transfer? Uh, yeah, I think that's what you mean. Yes, is it like the print? Like the print garments? Print to print? I wipe the oil off my mugs too. Yeah, if I do too. Cause this, I know I'm Vaseline on my hand because I just put Vaseline on my hand before I got here because I want you to talk about my ashy, ain't, my ashy knuckles. So I had to get that together so I know it's Vaseline. Okay, so that's all I see on here. Direct to garment. Okay, I knew what I say. Direct to what? Transfer. It's, so it's DGT. She said GT. Um, did she say DG, DTG? She said DG, DTF. So, no, I don't do that. It's too much money. I don't have any more money to spend. That machine is expensive, okay? I'm not buying no more no more machines. I said today, watch I buy some tomorrow. Something come out quick, come out with something, I'm going to get it. But not today, honey, not today. I'm going to just cut this because it's on with the black line to be on the picture. But if I do that, it's going to be smaller. I don't want that black line to be on the picture, on the cup. So, I'm going to cut this black line off. Okay, it's gonna be shorter. It's not gonna cover the whole front, whole front of the pit, pit but it's okay. It's okay. Make sure it's even and tape it. Oh, it's two different things. Y'all just taught me something. I didn't know it was a DTF and a DTG. I didn't know it was two of them. I thought it was just one. Direct, direct transfer to garment. Transfer to garments, some crap like that. But no, I'm not buying either one of them. <laughs> Wait, let you tell me how much it costs. <laughs> Cause I think it is cool because sometimes it's, you would you would love I would love to um sublimate on um dark 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 clothes. Okay, it's done now. And you don't have to worry about this being hot right here. This part right here is not hot, but the cup is hot. So what I do is I gotta find something to put. Let me get my mat so I won't mess up my my own. I just put it on my table over here. I want to put it on my mat and put it over here on my table and let it cool off a bit. Okay. Okay, so what's the price, y'all? <laughs> no, don't tell me the price. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go get it. Don't tell me the price, y'all. You, yeah, you can tell me. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'll be playing. All right, nothing else. <clears throat> okay, so let me go ahead and put the name on the back of this. Hey, Charmaine, nice to see you today. Hey, Gigi, I'm here. I've been doing lives a lot lately, y'all. I was supposed to do it. Was I supposed to do something else? Make a video on something, and I didn't. I think I was supposed to. I was supposed to uh, finish that shirt on um, a regular video, but I didn't because I was getting getting all frustrated and going crazy because I want to make sure I got it out. 
But today we're doing three mugs. We're supplementing three mugs with the Cricut Easy Press. Everybody love the Cricut Easy Press. I know I do. So if you want it, you should get it because I, I love it. It's so easy to use. I'm telling you, it's so much easier to use than other machines. But if you want to be cheap or like I was, I was cheap because I didn't want to spend all that money on stuff. I wasn't going to pay no $300 for no dang on mug press. I wasn't going to do it or no tumbler press. So I found me a tumbler press and right here is cheaper than $300. Cause usually I go presentation and get everything and they expensive. What's who said? She said it's a lot of money. Well, how much is it then? Let me see. How much is the machines are you using now? Girl talking about me? <laughs> a lot. Nah. Which one you talking about? What machine you talking about? I got a lot of machines. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. It's an investment, y'all. So if y'all know y'all gonna be a crafter, y'all wanna, you know, have a boutique or whatever. Invest in it because you will get your money back. Believe it. Believe me. Okay, so I'm about to put in this back in machine. Do you have to cover that with your paper? Nope, you don't have to cover that. That's what I'm saying. It's so much easier. I did when I first started using this. I was scared. I'm like, y'all tripping. Y'all need to cover that with paper. So I did cover it the first time. And then after I seen that you have to, girl, I'm telling you, it's so much easier. Nothing. Just tape and that's it and go with the flow. Okay, you just push it down and wait for it to beat. That's it. So y'all ready to see the first video, the first cup we did? Y'all ready to see it? Dimps, you about to get this machine, Dimps? Or do you have it already? Do you do tumblers, Dimps? Okay. Y'all ready to see it? I'm ready to see it. And I haven't had no problem. Use this one. Sometimes when you use the convection oven or the air or the air fryer, you do mess up. Okay? But I have not messed up a mug or on this with this dog on um cricket yet, okay? So let's see if it's gonna keep me. Okay, no ma'am, you she don't have it. Let's see if it's gonna still be my friend. I don't have no mixed ups, mix ups. Cause I, like I said, I have mixed up a thousand and one tumblers in my oven. Cause you gotta get that right heat and right temperature. Oh, that's black is popping. Let's I wanna see it first, y'all. I'll be excited. I see I like it, but I just don't like it's, it's black and white. But it's how it's how the picture is. It's gonna be like that. But um it's black and white. Just like my shirt. See how I'm black? It's black and white too, so it looks kind of like um, yellow. But it's cute. But I just wish she would have asked for color because color would have popped better. Which I think. Color just much be, would have been much better. See how the black popped though? That's straight. Lord Jesus. Which I think. It's black and white though. But it's cute because it's like I said. That's a cute picture. It's a nice picture. But I just like color. What y'all think? If y'all like it, say, give me some hearts or something. But it's like I said, it's not, I mean, the white, is don't do white. It always do yellow. Like my, like I said, this is black and white. It's like a yellow. It's don't, it, sublimation don't sublimate white. But if she would have had the color on that, ooh, it would have been. I mean, it's still cute. Don't get me wrong. It's cute, cute. Ooh, I just burnt myself. Okay, so let me let that cool off. Because watch me, this, this going to pop a little bit more because there's a color in it. So y'all can see the difference between a photo in the regular uh, uh image this is a um just a regular png image okay well i took the background off if you want to know how to remove a background go to remove background dot this is uh remove background.com i think and that uh, yeah the black and white is cute i'm just used to color it is cute though okay so now i'm gonna put the last one on here i'm just like i said when i got the video with y'all i'm gonna do some more of these because I want to get ready for my um get ready and this same lady that did that these cups she bought this um patch and show you this patch real quick real quick real quick quick and mug press on sale for 179 y'all better get that she just said y'all remove bg.com she just said the easy press is on sale for 179 you cannot beat that i'm telling y'all you can't beat that with a stick look because if you go on uh, <laughs> if you go on heat press nation their heat presses are like i mean their mug Presses are like 300 something dollars, maybe more than that. Because I was like, I'm not buying all that, I'm not paying for that. I'm not paying for that. So, that is a good price, y'all. And I'm telling you, it's worth it all. I mean, sometimes you might not be able to use some type of cups, some size of cups, but you could use 10 ounce, 12 ounce, 11 ounces, whatever. You could do so. You can even do tumblers in there. I got a video on how to do a tumbler. I would never do a tumbler again on it because I have a tumbler press now. But you could do a tumbler, you could do tumblers on here in here too. So, girl, I ain't trying to tell y'all spend y'all money, but if y'all doing mugs, y'all better get it. That's a great deal. I'm letting, I'm letting you know it's it's a nice machine to use. I'm telling you, telling you, telling you. Oh, shoot. 
kill myself, y'all. Okay, so this other patch I um, made for her. Got the Black Lives Matter on here. This is um embroidery patch. I just got to cut it around here because this is the sticky part. So they, she got to pull this off and she can iron it on the um, shirt. Yup, there it goes. Remove that BG. I got the last, I got one last year for five hundred dollars. What? See, I'm talking about that's too much. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have did it. That's why, that's why I bought my, my um, air press. What is it? I always get it wrong. My air fryer for a hundred some dollars. I wasn't about to buy no. I wasn't about to spend no more money on that. I said I won't be doing that. I won't be doing that. Who has it on sale, y'all? Somebody wanna know where's that? Checkcricket.com. If not, check Michaels or Joanne Fabric. But I didn't know, y'all. Before somebody told me, somebody was like, you need to go to Cricket. Cricket be having sales. I thought Cricket would have had the most expensive stuff. I would have thought they would have sold their stuff at, at their full price. But no, Cricket be having sales, y'all, on their website. So check out Cricket on their website, and you can get some sales. Especially their t-shirts, y'all. They t-shirts be going on sale. And I don't know why I'm talking with my hands. I don't usually do that. <laughs> the mugs from Condi, y'all. But Cricket got mugs, too. But they kind of, they more expensive. And I don't know, it might not be more for some Condi, because Condi, be they be jacking their prices up. But their quality is quality. Uh, Condi have quality stuff, but it is more expensive. It's, it, you can pay some money, but I like it because I know it's going to be quality. But you can also, some stuff that you get from Condi, you can get from um, places, different places. But I would not go nowhere but to, no, I'm not going to say nowhere else. I get my shirts from Jiffy, Jiffy, Jiffy Mix, JiffyShirts.com, and I get them from Condi. So I do go to Jiffy shirts.com to get my shirts not always Condi because Condi's are expensive but i like the it's more Condi shirts are quality jiffy shirts are quality too but you gotta make sure you get the right ones my patches how much are they check my website out please i have a lot of different patches on my website so check them out different prices different size somebody just told me they want a muhammad ali patch and i have a muhammad ali patch and i didn't know i didn't put it on my site so i gotta take a picture of the muhammad ali patch and put it on my site because somebody want one I don't know why. I'm glad she told me because I thought I had it on my site and it wasn't even on my site. And I'll also show y'all my, my um patches and stuff on my videos. I'm not gonna show it today. Okay, she said, Oh, cricket has the is on eBay. I don't I don't deal with eBay. eBay is scary to me. I don't know. I just don't be trusting eBay. I mean, I'm not saying this is legit. I mean, I just I never use eBay. That's right. I want to make sure the words are not coming off this cup. Okay, make sure that if you do this, easy. it's better for you to cut this kind. I know I said you to tear it, but it's easy to cut. It's better to cut so you can better line it up with the edge of the cup. So, yeah, when you're using, you still have to make no cup, cut it with the scissors. But I'm going to say it again. When you use it on your T-shirts, don't cut it with the scissors because I'm telling you, it'll be a line right here. The paper line will be across the shirt or right here. So, cut, I mean, yeah, cut the um, paper when you're using sublimation on, especially white shirts because white show everything. I'm telling y'all, y'all gonna say Charmaine told me to. You want me to get line across your shirt? You gonna be like, I should listen to Charmaine. Okay, I'll just put it, put that one inside. Let's check the other one, and we're gonna be out of here, y'all. It's still hot. So I can still take it off. Yes, Jiffy shirts are going up. Are they going up too? Yes, it does have leave line. Yep, I'm telling you. That was also said. It does leave lines. Ooh, we y'all. Oh shoot. I think I'm so cricket. I always make stuff cricket. Look at that. Look at that. See that that color? What's that in the background? I'm about to burn my lip. Look. Ooh, it's like I'm about to drink some coffee. That is nice. Look at that. Why is it got the I mean I can drink. This is my phone got a little uh shadow on it. Why is it looking <gasps> got a shadow on it for my phone it's not it's not the picture it's the phone that is cute i like that that is i told you that color be popping baby oh there you can see it better now look at that beautiful okay and i got it straight y'all but the name ain't too straight but it's gonna be all right I, i'm so bad with straightness look, i'm so bad with straightness but that's cute i love the color so y'all gonna see how this other one gonna pop too so I'm done with her order. Thank you, Jesus. I'm done. Y'all be understanding. I be doing these orders, and I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all for um for, for for coming to me. But I be ooh, I be trying to get it. And I be I be, uh, I be procrastinating. Hey, what is it? Best yet, journey. 
If y'all are new to this channel and it's your first time seeing a live, can you say virgin? And I will shout you out. We got one more cup to do and I'm gonna get off the live. I call that crooked eye. Yes, girl, I got crooked eye all the time. Like on my shirts, I'd be so scared. Every time I do a shirt, I get scared. Cause I'm like, oh my God, it's gonna be crooked. I gotta be sitting for like 15 minutes, not 15 whole minutes, but close to 15 minutes just to make sure. Hey, Virgin, hey, Lakeisha. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hey, Donna, Thomas, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe now. Hey, Lux, is it Luxy Skin? Lux Skin? Hey, Savannah, uh, what is it? Savannah, Savannah? I'm all messed up. So, so <laughs> I'm trying to get it. Uh, hey, uh, Katina. Hey, hey, all my newbies, all my virgins. I just, we just say virgins because we're new at something, okay? That's all it is. It's nothing nasty. It's just something you're new at. You're new at watching me, okay? Um, I have to get that machine. How do you keep the picture straight? By cutting it. Like I said, my crazy butt told y'all to tear, tear on t-shirts, but cut on mugs. And when you tear it straight, you'll be, I mean, I'm sorry, if you cut it straight, just line it up to the bottom of the cup, okay? That's how I get it straight. You cut it straight across make sure it's straight or you can use it use a cutter that's gonna cut it straight and as long as your bottom is straight you're good and you can measure it to the cup to make sure it's straight i mean to, um, even into this cup see how that is make sure that bottom is lined up to the cup and you're good that's how you keep it straight this is a black and white picture first one we did today the name on the back and it's the color picture we got one more to do which is not a photo it's just basically a, um i could have made this bigger so it can go off the cup it would have been cuter but i didn't and it's okay um, so I, like I said, you could do the whole cup, but I've never, I probably did one cup that was a whole cup. You gotta make your whole design. When you do a whole cup, you gotta make, basically get a whole sheet of paint, like get a whole design and just basically measure it for what the, the width of the cup is. So you get a blank, a blank background, you can, whatever you want to make it. And then you put the picture on there too, or whatever you want to do. But, um, then you got to make that whole background about... Uh, 10 inches. It's about to build my dang on ruler because it's still hot. <laughs> about 10 inches wide so it can cover the whole cup. But I don't like doing a whole cup because then your dog, gonna, this is still going to be um white. So unless you get those cups that have the color um handles, I don't like doing whole cups because they're going to still be white. So I don't do whole cups. And when I'm saying whole cups, I mean I don't sublimate a whole cup. I'm sorry. Hey, SMW. She's a virgin. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Please subscribe to this channel. I do videos. Probably try to do once a week, but I'll be coming up on here. I did... This week, I did two videos so far. I've been doing a lot of lives because it's much easier for me to get on and talk to y'all, ask y'all questions. It don't matter if somebody asked me the same question yesterday. I'm still going to answer them because people don't always watch my show, my videos, okay? So come on in, ask me questions. It's always I always have Q&As, um, and y'all can ask me whatever. It don't matter if it's cinemation, cricket, um, embroidery, ask away. I'm here. Whenever I'm doing a live, just ask questions. I'm here. Thank you for subscribing, SMW. We're just waiting on this cup to get done. And I'm out of here because I have to do some more stuff. I might go ahead and throw them patches on the embroidery machine, get those started. And I'm going to do some more mugs because I got a whole case from mugs that came in yesterday from Condi.com. Go to Condi.com. As for Chloe Smith, say my name, say my name, say my name, and she will give you a discount on the mugs. And also some more links I will put on my videos and under all of my other videos. Um, you can, if you purchase the links, I do get a certain percentage and that goes towards my channel to buy more mugs <laughs> or buy more machines. Okay, that's over with. It's done. And yes, I'm about to start doing um, face-to-face -face trainings. Um, summing up to, in Toledo, Ohio. But if you're not in Toledo, Ohio, you can, um, I can... I'm going to just let it cool off a little while. I can do a Zoom training for you. Um, I'm supposed to start the first of this month, but I see as I'm, I'm so doing so much. I'm going to start getting those dates and stuff out soon. Probably by this weekend, I'm going to try to get a flyer. I got to get a flyer made or whatever so I can start these classes up, okay? Probably going to be like a one-hour, two-hour training class or whatever, first face-to-face. -face. But if you're not here, we can do a Zoom training. If you need help, um, sewing or embroidery or cricket, please inbox me on Facebook, Charmaine Galloway, and leave your phone number, and I can call you and tell you when the um, training is going to be. And y'all can let me know if that's a good time for you. We can do a group training, we can do a one on one, or we can do a Zoom training. Like I said, the group training and one on one training is here in Toledo, Ohio. Um, I'm probably have like 10 or 12 people at one time for a group training. 
But then if you want to do a Zoom, of course, it's going to be one-on-one, -on -one, or you, we can have a group on that too. But I'm going to be doing beginning sewing classes, beginning sewing classes, and beginning cricket classes, and what else I say? Sewing sublimation. Not sublimation. I could do the Zoom on sublimation, but I'm just going to be doing the um the classes like face-to-face -face on sewing machines. I bought a few sewing machines, so they are ready to um be used. Broken into because they ain't even open yet. So inbox me on Facebook. Charmaine Galloway. She said, Where's my Facebook? It's Charmaine Galloway. Just message me. And now please, please, please ask. Uh, I know I have a lot of followers. Thank you so much. But if you go, if I do accept you on my Facebook page, please do not ask me how I make my things on my Facebook page. Because my Facebook page, my personal Facebook page, and my business business Facebook page, and my Etsy page is all for business. I, I advertise on those for my clients to reach me so they can purchase from me. So if you're in my group or if you're in my Facebook group and you're trying to learn how to do things, please inbox me and don't ask questions under my things that I'm trying to sell, trying to advertise. So that's not a good look. I appreciate you, but please inbox me or ask me on my channel, on my Facebook group or in my YouTube channel. Please and thank you. The cup is cooling off. Any questions? Any questions? Yes, Dimps. Like, I'm, I'm, only people think about it when they do it, but please think about it. It's not cool. That's all I gotta say. I love y'all. Um, okay, it's almost ready. Okay, it's still hot, but I'm, I'm gonna say, what I do? So let's see y'all, y'all ready? I'm about to look at it first, okay? <laughs> if y'all want to see this cup, let me see y'all put some thumbs up. I got 170 people watching. I got 160. Y'all doing good. That was only 10, te was only 10 people that ain't said, didn't say like, like this video. Only 10 people didn't like it. Can I get some more likes? Yep, thank you, Dems. Yes, somebody asked about that. Yep, that's the um, Sure Color 5. Girl, you be knowing before I even know. Like, she be knowing all my stuff, girl. I got to look at the picture and be like, wait a minute, what is this? You know, I got to write stuff on my wall to tell me what it is. <laughs> Thumbs up, man. Go out the video and thumbs up this video. Thumbs up the video for me. Hey, 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 hey. The words stay on the cup. It was really close, though, but it stayed on the cup. Y'all ready? Let me see the thumbs up. Like this video. Like the video. Okay, I got y'all. Y'all got me. There's 170 people that like it now. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Badow. How you like me now? I love color. Color is so beautiful, and that cricket thing be doing it. But like I said, it's not just cricket. Cricket is good, but I'm telling you, if you go, if you use an air fryer or a convection oven, it's gonna do the same thing, y'all. It's the same thing with the other machines, okay? So don't think it's just cricket, okay? And these mugs, it's whatever mug you get now. If you if your your stuff is faded and looking horrible, it's either the mug or the paper or the ink, okay? I use uh, I use um. Condi mugs. I use, oh, there's some tip. I gotta get a tip over there. I use Condi mugs. I use, um, uh, what I use, y'all? I use, um, ASAP paper. I use, uh, inkjet ink. No, did I use inkjet ink? What the heck I use? <laughs> what I use? Some, no dimps, no. What ink I use? Yes. Ink, 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 ink. Doggone it. It's up there. I get it. I get up in a minute. Somebody don't tell me what I use. Told y'all I don't know what I be using. Look at that. I'm sorry. I just, I just love. I just love color. Ink X. Look at them. Girl, she be know. <laughs> That's my girl. Give me a high five, girl. Give me a high five. Yeah, yeah. I use Ink X Pro. <laughs> girl. Told y'all I be writing stuff on stuff. Like, I don't be knowing. I got too much stuff to be thinking about. So, here we go. This is one cup. Yeah, you can get Ink X Pro. You can get Sub. You can get the um, A-Sub paper. You can get all that from Amazon, okay? And I do have links, y'all. 
Don't, not on this video, but because I'm not, I didn't put it in there yet. But go to my video from not yesterday, because I don't think I did that one yesterday either. But the day before yesterday, go to that video, and all my links are below, so you don't gotta worry about searching on Amazon for nothing. Just push the link and get it from my link. Okay? And we are done. I can call my customer and tell her she can come and get her cups, because she is here in my state. So, hey. Hey, I'm happy because I'm done. I'm always happy when I be done with something. Because I be work. I've been working, y'all. But I enjoy it. I enjoy working. Keep me busy. Keep me out of trouble. So what y'all want to talk about for the... Nah, let me see. What time is it? It's only 8.15. I don't want to... Let me unplug this machine because it's smelling. I don't want to do anything else tonight. I could measure these. Um, While I'm talking to y'all, I can go ahead and get these socks together. I got some socks to make. Two, two socks. So she wanted maroon, red, and black. So I might go ahead and do these. I, mean, I can go ahead and measure these socks real quick. Yeah, I only measure it right here with my my thing right here, my ruler, my setting. What? Oh, what the heck? She wanted these colors. Did I just... Yeah, whatever. Let me think. What? Why am I doing these socks over again? I thought I already did these. Okay, I'll think about this later. I ain't gonna worry about this. I think I. Gotta make sure I got the right size. So I ain't gonna worry about that. They don't take that long at all to do these socks. But these socks are the bomb, y'all. If y'all wanna check the socks out, check on my website. What's the Mation Eco Tank Printer first time should go? What? What's the Mation Ink Printer? I don't know. I never use Echo. She said Echo Printer. I never used the Echo Tank Printer before. So anybody can help her, please answer her question. She said, What's the Mation Echo Tank Printer first timer should get? I don't have an Echo, an Echo, Echo, or Echo, Echo. I don't have one of those. I have the, just the plain. Sublimation, well, it's not a sublimation printer. It's you, you convert it to sublimation. It's just a basically, it's a basic Epson 7710 or 7720. If you want to learn how to co convert it, you can do check out my video. Happy anniversary, Lisa. This is gonna make her a cup for her anniversary. It's so easy. Photos are nice. Like I said, people wanted to know how to do photos. It's just like this is a regular pay, uh, uh, PNG. You just basically have somebody. Make sure they send you a nice, clear photo. They can text it to you. They can email it to you. But make sure it's a nice photo that you can stretch it. Um, and then you just basically download it to your computer. Download the silhouette. And there you go. Just like you do PNGs. So people have been asking me for this video. So I brought it to ya. It's easy, easy, easy peasy. Any other questions? You have two anniversaries. How you have two anniversaries? I mean, I know you can have two anniversaries, different things going on. But what are they? Uh, let me see. I have a brother. So I guess they're telling y'all about, what's, Fevelosis, what you talking about? From a brother's, what is that? A, it's a, a, a sewing machine? DX. I never heard of that. Is that a sewing machine? Of course, or is it, is it a sewing machine or a brother machine? I don't think it's a brother machine though. Um, I have some tools. Don't know how to change the place. Okay, GG. Seventy-eight twenty. Seventy-eight twenty. Is that Epson? I was being lazy. Didn't want to do the, do the conversion. Okay. Um, check out my video. I have a video on how to simply, how to convert a printer to sublimation printer. It's scary because you your first time doing it, but it's not. It's okay. It's okay. So it's okay. I'm scared. Of everything I did time I start something first time, I'm scared too. And I wait, and I wait, and I procrastinate. Then when I do it, I'm like, really? Is this all? I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, I'm the main one. I'm doing orders and stuff. I'm like, oh my god, I'm scared. I'm gonna mess up a shirt. I wait till last minute to do it. So I have to do it because it's last minute. And I'll be like, really, Charmaine? You really procrastinating? And you did this a thousand and one times. But every time I do something, I always get scared because it always can mess up. Cause I like, I always sometimes mess up. I'm perfect. Yes, honey. She said, um, you can use the air fryer. To to do a mug. I have a video on that too, honey. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Check out my videos. An air fryer and a convection oven. They're cheaper than these machines. These heat presses. Check it out. I'm telling you. You're going to be like, what? Yes. Check and see. This, this, my video is called a, air, a mug and air fryer. Somebody made a mug and air fryer. Put that into YouTube and you'll see me. You'll see my face. Check them out. Air fryer, honey. But don't use it for your food, honey. After you finish using it for your cups, don't use it for your food. I got one just, I got two air fryers, the same one. One in my kitchen and one down here in the basement. 
Yes, try it out. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Go to Walmart, go to Michael's, get you, I mean, not Michael's, Walmart or uh, Myers or somewhere, get you a little cheap air fryer. Just don't get you that mini one. Get you a, a big enough one so you can better put mugs in. That'll fit a mug, of course. About eight minutes and you done. You have you a cooked mug. Hey, Miss Virgin, Rhonda, thank you for joining. Please subscribe. I'm just looking at your comments. Okay, like these printers back here, the Epson, the Epson 7710, 7720, they were $100 when I bought them before the pandemic. Girl, not about $300. Just like these embroidery machines was like $800, they were cheap. Now they're about $1,000 and something. So everything was cheaper. I got everything. I'm so glad I got it before the pandemic because now everything is it's very expensive. Anything else, y'all? What I'm gonna do today now that I'm free? Like I said, I'm gonna do some. Um, I'm so thankful. I only got three more orders, but I got some people that just ordered something to me from me today. So I gotta do a glass, a bling. Somebody just ordered a bling, bling wine glass from me. Oh, I got, I got more. I got ribbon socks to do over there. I forgot about those ribbon socks. I gotta do. I thought I only had three orders to do. No, I don't. I got ribbon socks to do. I got three pair of ribbon socks to do over there. I got a, 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 a wine glass, two wine glasses to do. And I have a pair of shoes to do. This is my first time doing a pair, well, a whole pair of shoes. I got to do a whole Converse, put some bling bling on the Converse. My first time, y'all pray for me. I'm scared. See, I'm scared. And guess when it's due? On Friday. So I procrastinate because I'm scared. So y'all ain't the only one. So I'm going to get it started, though. I got to get it started by Monday because I, that's, them bees, whew, they ain't no joke. They small. So I'm going to start it on Monday. Y'all wish me luck on these Converses. I will show y'all. I ain't going to do a video on it because, um, could be way too long but i probably do like a um a tiktok so check out my tiktok i do a little quick glimpse on how i look before and how i look in the middle and how i look afterwards so and i got a tiktok too video i'm gonna probably upload a tiktok video tonight on that big old patch i did like a six by nine lol dial patch oh my god it was so cute y'all it was so cute I, um i'm gonna do a tiktok on video tonight i put that on, on tiktok tonight so check out my tiktok i'm sorry i feel myself talking fast my brain be just Okay, if that's not it, y'all, I guess I'm going to be out of here. Let me show you this patch I did today. The same lady that ordered them two mugs, she ordered this patch too. She ordered some notebooks from me too. What else she ordered from me? I think that's it. No, two journals. So I do have journals and notebooks. Stuff. They just basically got to, just, they got to just peel this white thing off. I put the instructions in the um, package. You know how to iron them on to your little garment. So she wanted the Black Lives Matter fabric. And little, she's so cute. I could put any kind of fabric. I put the African fabric in here. I could put Stiller's fabric in here. I could do whatever you want with these um girls with the little hood on the back of it. And I got the little boy too with the hood on it. So I can do that too with him. But I've been saying a lot of her. A lot of people like like her. What's too much work for you, Dimps? I gotta get these eyebrows done, y'all. I look horrible. Them done tomorrow. Any other questions? What you talking about, Dimps? I gotta think about this dang on socks. I got these socks too, and I don't have no invoice, so I don't know what I did. Why is I'm sitting right there? I gotta figure out who. Oh, that's what I did. Somebody ordered a pair of socks. Oh my god, I'm so. And I only put one in her order. I forgot that she ordered two, so that's what I had to do. That's why it's sitting there. Because I only I think about it, I was like, oh my God, I only made one pair of socks. See, I'm not perfect, so just forgive me if I make a mistake, but I'm going to make them now and ship them off to her. I ain't had to tell you that, but I'm not perfect, so things happen. I was like, I know I didn't make no two socks for her, two pair of socks. So that's what it was. I got to make this. So I'm sitting here like, what is this for? Why is this here? But I know, but I'm invoice. She wanted to burn, um, two pair of these and only made her one. So please be careful, y'all. Check this. Make sure y'all check out invoices. Because, Lord Jesus, I shipped her stuff out yesterday, so I'm about to go ahead and do these tonight so I can so she can get them. Lord, be my guide. Be my, be my guide. Yeah, I have a video on how slicing images on de on design space. Are your SCs? Are you on SC? Where can I find you? Yes. Um, they, they go, <laughs> look at Dim's post. She just put it out there for me. That's my girl. Yep. She put my um my um Etsy link down there. It's um Etsy Charming Gal Boutique and Araya. 
in a ray of sunshine 2020 oh yeah see so just click on those links that she just put in the um in the thing thank you dimps i appreciate you girl Okay, get my hair done again because these braids is, I don't like these braids no more. They got to got what what you say? Oh, I get the ribbon from um what is big school spool of ribbon I got from um hope it's an, I hope the name on here because I sure forgot who the name was. Where I get my ribbon from Dimps. <laughs> she know everything. she know everything. I got this ribbon from a place where you get Tulu from. The big this is a big roll of Tulu, and this is so good. But they out of everything. It's they sell Tulu. They, I'm sorry, they sell tool and they also sell ribbon. And I don't know, it's not, it's a big company, but they out of everything. So, and I love this big spool because it's so much better to buy the big spool. You're doing, I do tutus and I do socks. But these, I like, th these are good. If you get them from Hobby Lobby, they're cheaper at Hobby Lobby when they're on sale. So, the ribbon's going to sell every other week and the fabric going to sell every other week. So get this from Hobby Lobby. Get these ribbons from Hobby Lobby if you can't get online. But I got this from an online store, and I can't think of the name of it. Um, no, it's not AJ Blank. Oh, I think somebody said it. it's not AJ Blanks. It's something else. It's another place that sells bulk tool. I always, I always call it Tulu. It sells bulk tool. Okay, y'all getting tired. I just ate and I'm hungry again. I want some ice cream. Ooh, y'all, that sounds real good. What time is it? 8.30? I'm going to dip his clothes. Hey, do y'all have a um, BB Crafts? BB Crafts, yeah. She said BB something. Yes, BB Crafts. Yeah, but get it from bbcrafts.com. And they order everything. Man, because I be wanting that Tulu. Tulu. So, yeah, I'm going to go to a restaurant. I mean, ice cream place called, oh, my God, that's not with some charbo, like a little, they got the brownie with the ice cream on top of it. Oh, my God, I'm going to get that right now. That sounds so good. What is the name of that the ice cream place? They got them everywhere, Florida, everywhere. I didn't know we had it in Ohio until I went to Florida one time. And it was like, I was like, ooh, this ice cream good. And I came home, I was like, I know we had it here, too. It's addictive. What is the name of that darn place? Said she need to eat. <laughs> Get some food. I ate already. Now I want some ice cream. What is the name of the ice cream? I know y'all got Cold Stone. Cold Stone. Y'all got Cold Stone. I know y'all got Cold Stone because I don't had it in Florida. Yes, yes, this. You be know. be reading my mind, girl. Yes, Cold Stone. I'm telling you, y'all got it. If y'all y'all be like, man, tell me to come here and get this. I mean, it's brownie. So you put the brownie on the bottom. You put vanilla ice cream on top with caramel and peanuts. Hey, oh, that sounds so good. I want to go get one. And they make them warm up that brownie real good. Make it warm up. Girl, I can't even wait to get in the car. I'm eating it so, so I can have a hot brownie. And I don't even like sweets like that. I don't like sundaes and stuff like that. But that right there, oh, I'll tear, I'll tear that thing up. Cold stone, y'all. I didn't even know we had one in Ohio until so I went to Florida. And I, they was like, uh, I read it, I ate it. I'm like, hey, I'm gonna, let me check and see if they got it in somewhere closer to where, we live, where I live at. Man, they got one right here in my city. Even though, yes, it is. Cold Stone is the bomb. I'm about to go. It was right down to from my house, y'all. Now, they might be closed, y'all. It's 8.30. But, yours went out a bit. Oh, y'all seeing this? Really? Man, what you, uh, what I'm saying? Fabulous. But yeah, I'm thinking about doing a move. I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about the ice cream. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> my mouth is watering. <laughs> I'm about to um do a move. I'm thinking about doing a move. I can say nothing right here on the slide because I don't want to know where I'm going right now. But some people know. But um, I'm doing a big move soon. Hopefully by the first of the year. And I'm excited. So y'all pray for me. She said, is Alabama? <laughs> no. But I'm not saying anything else. But uh, I'm about to be, I'm about to do a move. So hopefully it works out, and I'll y'all see me when I when I when I get there. Um, <laughs> um, that's all I gotta say. But anywho, I'm excited because I was talking about people today, so I'm excited about it. So I did got a lot, got a lot of stuff accomplished, accomplished today. So I'm excited. So if everything work out, I'll be somewhere, somewhere somewhere with some beaches i'm in ohio now and we don't have no beaches here beaches i said i said beaches okay let me get out of here anything else 
You said just up move halfway. <laughs> okay, we'll see if we, I might be half, it might be halfway. Beach sound nice. Yes, I've been working since I was 16. I'm 42. It's time for me to get what I want. Yeah, she said, hey, yes. I'm about to be moving, so I need to be on the beach. I love the water, so I can go, to, I can walk. I don't know if I can walk, but I can drive and walk on the beach. So that's what I'm, I'm excited about that. Um, it's a new thing, new, you know, new year that's coming up. Hopefully I'll be on somebody's beach living there. Not living on the beach, but living close to a beach. A nice clean beach, not the Ohio beach, Mommy River. Mommy Beach, uh, something I want to say. Like, oh, that's that's nice. <laughs> okay, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the good love, the wishes. I'm I'm trying. Oh, you're two hours away from where I'm, I might be close. Them, so I might I might get to drive to you then. You never know. But I have to go now because y'all not even asking me no questions. It's eight thirty. A, who said <laughs> maybe 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 somebody said it but maybe 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 i'll be <laughs> i'll be somewhere by a beach this start next year i know i know see i'll be trying to come early dimps i'll be trying to come early because I'll be, be here all night. So I was like, let me get on here right now before my night, before I come in here and start doing stuff. So I, my intention was to be here like around six. Things popped up, but my ice cream. Yes, bye. I'll be, see, I'll be making me talk. I'll be forgetting. Go get my ice cream and party clothes, but bye. See y'all next time. It'll be probably next week sometime. Have a good night.